Welcome one and all to our Hardball Central Studios. This is Jeannie Zalasko here with Steve Fiziak as we get ready for this National League Divisional Series matchup here on 2K Sports. The Houston Astros really needed a win in this one tonight. After dropping the series opener, they need to at least take this thing home with a split in a guaranteed game four. They got off to a bit of a stumbling start in this series. It can be a tall order to win these big games on the road. But if you want to get to the World Series, you have to be able to compete against anyone at any place. Meanwhile, the boys on the other side of the diamond have to be feeling pretty good about establishing the early lead. The home field advantage really paid off for them in game one. Now they're going to focus on taking this series to the break before going on the road for the next one. There's a lot. Thanks, Steve. Time for the call by John Miller and Joe Morgan. Hi, guys. Okay, Jeannie. Now let's get back to the game. Game two of the division series coming your way. Man, that's what you call pop in the mid. Right on the outside corner. Down and away. The pitch. Jones will have to be very careful now. He's in a deep hole. It's 0 and 2. He deals. A swing and a miss. Strike three, but he's headed for first. And that's in plenty of time for the out. Now let's take a look at the batting order for the Padres. Adrian Gonzalez is in the third spot. Nobody on base with one out. This is swung on and a liner. That one gets through and for a base hit. And he pulls into first with that base hit with one out. Here's a quick look at the Astros and how they line up on defense. One out, man on first. He swings and hits this one pretty well. Deep right center. Number nine loves it for the out. So two down now, and the runner holds on at first. This is some awesome advanced scouting. They had the outfield playing back, so he was in the right position to make this play. Michael Barrett comes to the plate, still looking for his first home run in this series. Pop foul straight back. Here's the pitch. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Oh, and he bobbles this thing. Wigginton. And the throw is too late, so all hands are safe. He winds up with a throw he has to make all the way across the diamond. He just couldn't get it there in time. Now, if this was a throw being made by a second baseman with his arm, uh, I don't think it would have been any kind of a play at all. He wouldn't have even had a chance at it. But uh, this guy had enough speed to beat that long, strong throw. Absolutely. Ryan Giles up to the plate. Here's a swing and a drive. Deep center. Bounces up against the wall. And the runner will come in to score. Here comes his throw home. And now the runner comes around to score from first. Kevin Kuzmanov up now. Still looking for his first home run in this series. Runner on second. Two down. Now a spin and a throw back to second. A dive, but he's back in easily. Here's a spin and a throw behind the runner. Two down and a runner on second. And he delivers. Slider swung out of miss. 0 and 1. Drilled towards the hole. And what a spectacular play. The Padres scored two runs on two hits and one man left. Now we'll go to the bottom of inning number one. San Diego's out in front. Two to nothing. Tom Glavin getting rid of toe the slab as the starting pitcher for them. And the manager really likes what he's seen from this guy here in the postseason as he has really turned it up a notch. Well, John, you can take your pick of any adjective you want to describe today's starter, Tom Glavin. He's crafty, he's smart, he's consistent, but this guy is just simply a great pitcher. You rarely see him groove anything. He can spot the fastball on the black better than any pitcher in the game. 
One strike to count. Tom Glavin. Circle change and a beauty. And it's 0-2. Ground ball to second. Iguchi picks it up. Over to first for out number one. That's a nice textbook defensive play, John. This ball is stealing by the second baseman, and he gets the easy force at first base. One out, nobody on. First pitch on the way. And he sends this one in the air towards center. Jones is in his tracks as he puts this one away. He just gets him to swing underneath this thing and lost an easy fly to center. Good pitch. Now look at the umpiring alignment for today's game. This is a great bunch of officials, John. Top notch. The pitch. Swing at a high pop up on the infield over into foul territory. Gonzalez is there now and he puts it away to retire the sound. Nothing doing here this afternoon. We'll go to the top of the second. The Padres lead it two to nothing. It's the bottom three of the batting order coming up. Ground ball toward the second baseman. Matsui. Throw on to first in time one away. He gets good wood on this one but the second baseman says hey I'll take care of this and he throws him out at first. Base is empty. One out. Starts him out with a fastball for a strike. Well, after the pitcher came down and in with this pitch, you might see him go away on the next pitch. No balls and a strike. The pitch from Garcia. Hit in the air to center field. Number nine is right there, and he hauls it in. That's about as easy as it gets for a center fielder. Glavin will step in for his first plate appearance of the day. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch, here it comes. High and tight for ball one. Here's the 1-0 delivery. Called strike at the knees. One ball, one strike. Man, you don't want to throw it there in the middle of the plate. Here's the 1-1 one, one delivery. Line foul toward first. Here's the 1-2 pitch on the way. Here's a swing and a ground ball. Tejada fields. Throws to first. In time for out number three. So they go down in short order. Now we'll move on to the bottom of the second. San Diego has the lead. Two to nothing. The big hitters, power hitters, the middle of the batting order coming up. Swung on and hit down the line and left. This one into the corner. Out of here. A home run. Well, it looked like he tried to throw him a cutter. Not a bad pitch in that spot, but I don't think it had enough movement on it, and he waited for it. Yeah, that's the definition of what happens when a cutter doesn't cut. You're absolutely right. Base is empty with nobody out. On the way. Here's an off-speed pitch in there for a strike. On one. He kicks. He throws. He looks at a fastball in there, and it's quickly 0-2. Here's a swing and he pops it up. Green puts it away for the out. 
Ty Wigginton gets a shot here. He has not yet knocked in a run in this series. Nobody on base with one out. First pitch to him. Fastball in there for a called strike. That pitch was up and in. It got the inside corner, but I don't think the batter saw it that way. On the ground to third, Kuzmanov. And he throws the first in time for out number two. Kenji Jojima comes in. He's hit one homer in the series so far. Two outs, nobody on. If he wasn't able to get out of the way of that pitch, he'd be moving down the first right now. The 1-0 pitch on the way. This pitch runs up and in, and he doesn't want to offer at it, and I don't blame him. Now the 1-1 pitch. There's a swing and a ground ball. Here's Tom Glavin with his 1-2 pitch. That fastball just about had him, and it's 2-2 two and two now. With two strikes, you throw the power fastball upstairs, you'll get the hitter to chase it a lot of times, but he laid off. The 2-2 two, two pitch. Ground ball. Two-two two pitch on the way. Big curveball just about had him. Now to full count. Full count. Tom Glavin ready. And he looks at a fastball in there, and the side is retired. The Houston Astros narrow the deficit a bit as they pick up a run on the homer. We'll go to the top of inning number three. The Padres on top two to one. Hit to the ground toward second. Makes its way through for a base hit. So he's aboard with a base hit with nobody out. Iguchi will be the batter. Singled his last trip to the plate. Good time to try to steal right here, John. If you want to win ball games in this league and keep pressure on teams, you've got to utilize that running game. He delivers. Just missed with the fastball. Ball one. Well, most hitters aren't going to chase that pitch down and away because they can't hit it anyway. Now the 1-0 delivery from the drill towards third. And he's got it. Spectacular. Third base will get a lot of action when they pull the liners down there like this one, John. Yeah, you got to be quick. Make that play. Otherwise, it's going to be extra bases. Absolutely. With one out, there's a runner at first. Round to the second, could be two. Matsui to second for one. And two, a double play. So, no runs, one hit, and nobody left. Now we'll go to the bottom of the third. San Diego has the lead, two to one. And the number is eight. Swing and a ground to the first. And that gets through for a base hit. And he's going to try and stretch it into a double. And he'll stop at second with a double. John, sometimes hitting is just like real estate. Location, location, location. This one gets out to a spot that allows him to take two. John, this guy doesn't have the wheels to try to steal third base right here. They just got to hope for some timely hitting. Fastball just misses. One ball, no strikes. Well, the toughest pitch in baseball to hit is the fastball that's up. But sometimes you're able to lay off of it. One ball, no strikes to count. Tom Glavin to the plate. He tried to bring that from the back door, but he missed with it, just hung out there. Now 
Guy sets. Here's the 2 and 0 pitch. You should never hang the curveball inside. If you keep that ball in on the hitter and it's spinning, he has a chance to just drive it. Always keep the curveball away. He's on top, the 3 and 0 pitch. Fastball in there for a strike. 3 and 1. Now the 3 1 pitch. 3 1 pitch is a fastball that's by him. 3 and 2. Full count. Tom Glavin ready. And it's fouled off. The 3 2 pitch. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. Gonzalez. And he's in there easily. He does his job here. Gets the ball on the ground to the right side. And the runner moves over to third with one out. Man at third, one out. They're down by one, but the fans are still cheering. This ballpark is pumped. He throws. It's on the outside corner for a strike. Great location with the cutter. If you keep it there, you can get everybody out. One strike to count. Here's a swing and a fly ball hit medium deep. Might be enough to get him in. Jones is going to get there and make the catch for the out. He has to come in on this one a bit, but he's able to get there in time to put it away. Matsui, he's a switch hitter batting right-handed. Two outs, run around third. Just missed with the fastball. Ball one. Sometimes you stay away just to set up the pitch inside. Let's see if he comes back inside with this one. One ball, no strikes to count. Top swing and a bouncer up the middle. Iguchi throws on the first in time to retire the side. The Astros get no runs on a hit and they strand a man at third. We're through three here at the ballpark. The Padres lead it two to one. The middle of the order, the four, five, six spots. Here's a swing and a liner into left center. And an acrobatic catch. What a play. Here's some action on the replay. 2K Sports top play. Erstad may have just turned in our defensive play of the game here. Well, I know this will be tough to beat, John. Good jump on the ball. He really reads the ball well. And he reads it right off the bat, and he's able to get himself in a position. He leaves his feet and makes a diving catch. Swings and misses at the curve. 0-1. Freddie is ready and delivers. He fouls that one off. Swing and a miss. Giles goes down swinging. Strike three. Man, that's a hard slider with a nice leg break, John. That's a great two-strike pitch. Tough one to hit. Kuzmanov will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Bases empty, two down. First pitch on the way. Swing and a line drive. And he's got it. What a play. Nothing doing here this happening. We have the last of the fourth. The Padres lead two to one. The three, four, five spots in the order coming up next. Swing and a liner back up the middle. That looks like a base hit. He stops at first with the single. He's a good high ball hitter. He sees that pitch up in the zone and he whacks at it. As a pitcher, you've got to know the strengths and weaknesses of every guy you face. First pitch, here it comes. Looked like the circle changed and it just misses. One ball is down. Well, he tried to make a perfect pitch, but he misses down and away.
Now he sets. Here's the one open. And a foul ball. Now the 1-1 pitch. This one's hit pretty well to deep left center field. It's off the wall on a hop. And he'll hold up at second with a double. He just tears the cover off this one right through that left field gap. And he cruises in with a double. And this is what the players like to call gut check time, Joe. Black is in a big mess right now. Nobody out. Runners on base. John, this guy has all the right pitches in his arsenal, but he's just got to use them effectively here. As long as he moves the ball around the zone and changes speeds, I think he'll be okay. He's at the belt. The one up. Here's a swing and a fly ball to right center. Jones. Runs over. Here comes the runner for the plate. One runner in. The center fielder has to range to his left, and he's able to track it down over there and put it away. Ty Wigginton steps up now, still looking for his first home run in this series. Now in second, one out. And he delivers. Fastball just misses. One ball, no strikes. Well, they're setting up inside, but just missed off the inside corner. One ball, no strikes to count. Top. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Iguchi picks it up. On the first, two down. He gets his man over to third, but with two outs now, that doesn't help a lot. Kenji Jojima up to the plate now. He's hit one homer in the series so far. Two outs, a runner 90 feet away over third base. Now with two down in the inning, they're going to put him on free of charge. I don't understand this move at all, John. You've already got two outs in the inning. This guy isn't a world-class hitter, so it's just puzzling to me why they put a man on in this situation. Well, it's all about the love of the game. The crowd is going crazy. Listen to him, go. One strike to count. Tom Glavin. Good movement on that cutter, and he's in the hole. 0 and 2. On the ground to first. Gonzalez, and he'll step on first to retire the side. The Astros pick up a run on two hits, and they've left a couple of men on base. And we'll head to the fifth here in Houston. And we are all tied. It, that swung on at a high fly ball to right. Horn comes on to make the catch for the out. Not a bad swing, but he's too far underneath it. And the result is an easy fly to right. One out, nobody on. First pitch on the way. Swung on and hit in the air to right center. He's going to try and stretch it. Can't cut it off as it rolls all the way to the wall. And he's into second with a double with one out. Glavin will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. One out, a runner on second. A throw back to second. Trying to keep him close and he's back in time. Just focus on making good pitches right here, John. Don't worry about the man on second because he's probably not fast enough to steal third. He throws. He squares around and gets down the bunt. Garcia on the first four out number two. Well, he got the bunt down, but I don't know if that accomplishes much. He got a run on third with two outs. Man at third, two down. And he's going to 
to try for home. Now the 1 0 pitch. One ball, one strike. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground. Wigginton throws on to first, and the side is retired. The Padres pick up a run on one hit, and nobody left on. We go to the last of the fifth. San Diego out on top, three to two. The numbers nine, one, and two spots coming up next. And he watches a cut fastball to start the at-bat for strike one. The pitch. This is swung on and hit on the ground. Glavin. And his throw is in time for the first out of the inning. Good reaction by the pitcher. He makes the play and throws on the first. One out, none on. He delivers. Fastball swung on a missed 0 and 1. Hit of the ground up the middle. Green. And a good throw gets him. Two down. The shortstop makes a nice play here, and they get the horse out at first. Matsui will dig in. He's a switch hitter. Batting from the right side here. Two outs, nobody on. And he hits this one foul. Fouled off. Ooh, they're going to uh, appeal that one to the first base umpire. And he swung at it. That's the ruling. And they ring him up. The umpire overruling the plate umpire. Ruling that a swing for the strikeout. First pitch to him. That's at the knees for a call strike. He deals. Grounded towards third, but that'll go foul. The swing and a line drive. The dive, and he's got it. What a play. Here is some action on the replay. 2K Sports top play. Tejada. Gonzalez will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. Base is empty with one out. Here's the pitch. Swung on and grounded towards the hole. Matsui. And he throws the first in time for out number two. Barrett will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. Two outs. Nobody on. First pitch on the way. Pops him up and way up there. Berkman puts it away for out number three. No runs, no hits, and no one left on. Now we'll go to the last of the six. The Padres on top, three to two. The numbers three, four, five spots in the order is coming up next. First pitch is a fastball in there for the strike. This one he's just going for the strikeout, letting it all go. Great velocity. That's a strike, and Berkman with an 0 2 count will have to be very careful. 0 and 2. Let's see if they want to finish him right here or waste one. Low one outside of that one, and it's one and two. That one almost got the outside corner, but it's still down and away. 
Well, he wants to get a big hit here. He's down by one, and the fans are really into this one. Berkman takes the ball to even the count. Well, he tried to hit the inside corner. That one just moved off the plate in. A lot of movement, though. The 2-2 two -two pitch. Ball strikes through Berkman. Looks at one and is out of there. The catcher sets up down the way, and the pitcher hits the target perfectly. Strike three. Tejada will step in. He homered back in inning number two. One out, nobody on. They're down by one, but the fans are still cheering. This ballpark is pumped. He throws. Too far outside, one and all. That pitch is a curveball away. It just stays out there, and the hitter is able to lay off of it. One ball, no strikes to count. Tom Glavin to the plate. And he looks at a fastball in there. One ball, one strike. The 1 1 pitch on the way. Oh, tough to lay off that one, but it's 2 and 1. Glavin with a 2 and 1 count delivers a fly ball. That one is foul. The 2-2 coming. And Tejada unable to make contact. Strike three swinging. That's a hard-breaking curveball right there. He threw it right past him for the strikeout. Number nine. Go bat here. He drove in a run earlier in this game. Base is empty. Two down here. And it's fouled away. One strike to count. Tom Glavin. The 0 1 pitch is a good hard cutter in for a called strike. Toughest spot for a hitter. 0 and 2. The pitcher has a lot of pitches he can play with. Here's the pitch. Trying to get him to chase one, but he wouldn't. That's ball one. I like the way he's changing speeds. He's moving the ball in and out, but this one is down and away. A one two pitch coming. Circle change very tough to lay off there but he did and now it's two and two. Well the hitter is fooled by the speed of the pitch but because it stays inside he doesn't have to swing. Here's the two two pitch. Fastball swung out and missed and the side is retired. Then they're gone in short order. On to the seventh inning we go. San Diego has the lead three to two. Five, six, seven hitters coming up next. Has him out front as he swings and misses. Strike one. Now ball grounded foul wide to third. Wigginton. And he throws on to first for the out. One away. That's a nice throw by the third baseman to get the runner at first. That's why those third basemen have good arms. They have to use them on occasion. Nobody on base with one out. First pitch on the way. Sinker swung on and missed. It's 0 1. Here it comes. Swung on, bounced weakly to second. Masney throws to first, and he's retired for out number two. Good reactions out there on the mound to glove this thing and throw to first. Base is empty, two down. <laughs> On the way. A smash toward the hole. Berkman makes the catch, and that ends the inning. Nothing across here in the end. Seventh inning stretch time in Houston. The Padres lead it three to two.
The numbers six, seven, eight hitters are coming up. Grounded up the middle. Green. And his throw gets him. One away. That was a nice throw by the shortstop. He winged it over the first to get the hitter out. Base is empty. One out. First pitch to him. Here's one pop foul. Out in front of that pitch and he's in a deep hole. It's 0 and 2. He's way ahead in the count. All the pressure falls on the hitter now. He's got to make contact. Change up called strike three and that's the second out. Well the manager likes to see that three pitches and you send him back to the bench. Yeah that's a pitcher's delight that is domination. Two outs nobody on. First pitch on the way. Looked like the circle change and it just misses. One ball no strikes. Well, to get that pitch down and not up, the hitter has to chase it. Here's the 1 0 delivery. Here's one pop foul to the left side. Here's the 1 1 delivery. The 1 1 pitch is a circle change and hits the target 1 and 2. The one two pitch hit in the air to left center and that gets down for a base hit. and with two down they've got a man aboard here he chased it off the plate and made solid contact that's a good piece of hitting two outs a man on first he kicks he throws inside for a ball one and oh ready with the one oh pitch the next pitch misses high for ball two well the key to the changeup is arm speed he had good arm speed there but he left it up high He's ready for two and open. Oh when you mix speeds with accurate location, this is what you get. You get a win. He's ready. Now the two one pitch. Good fastball here. That's like watching a mini rocket go by. Now the 2-2 pitch. Big curveball just about had him. Now to full count. The runner go. There he goes for second. Well, with a 3-2 count, everybody's looking for the fastball. He got the fastball, but it was out of the zone. Good job by the hitter not to chase it. Two men on, two men out. First pitch, here it comes. Just off the plate, and that's ball one. He's at the belt. The one up swing and a ground to the first. Gonzalez, and he'll step on first to retire the side. Pitch on the way. Now he swings and sends it deep to right field. That ball is way back there. He vaults himself high above the earth to pull that one in. Wow. 
And it looks like they're going to talk it over on the mound. I'm not sure if they're going to switch pitches here. We'll just have to wait and see what they decide. Glavin will be the batter. 0 for 1 thus far. Base is empty with one out. None on. Swings and misses at that fastball. It's 0 and 1. He delivers. Now here's the ball grounded towards the hole. Wigginton on the first. Two down. The third baseman makes a nice play here. He stays on top of this one. Makes a nice throw over the first and is able to retire the runner. Two outs, nobody on. First pitch to him. There's a swing and a drive deep right field. Bourne has got it and the side is retired. No runs, no hits, nobody left. Here come the Astros in the last half of the eighth. San Diego out on top, three to two. The number two hole will be getting things started next. And time is called for a meeting here, and this may just be to buy a little time for the bullpen to get ready. It's time when everybody in the bullpen gets up, shakes off the dust. And you never know how long he's going to stay with this pitcher now. Being called in, and he's going to be the new pitcher. He has no decisions in this postseason. Well, they're going to go to their closer here in the eighth inning in hopes of shutting the door early. He's probably looking to conserve energy for the night, so you know he'll be looking to get out of this one very quickly. That's a foul ball. The pitch. Swing and a ball pop foul to the left side. Side like that, but he didn't hit him that time. The one two pitch coming high for a ball, two and two. Two two pitch. Swing and a miss on the curveball. One down. When you pitch a hitter inside, you better not make a mistake and get it over the plate. He does it right here. Perfect pitch. Down and in. Berkman comes in now. He's a switch hitter, batting from the right side. One out, nobody on. They're down by one, but the fans are still cheering. This ballpark is pumped. Swung on and grounded foul by the first. Well, he's hearing his name in his home ballpark, but they still trail by one in this ball game. He kicks, he throws. There's a swing and a rocket toward short. Green, and he throws the first in time for out number two. This is a textbook play by the shortstop. Nice throw to first to get him out. Two outs, nobody on. Betancourt gets the call to come in and take over the hill. This is his first save opportunity in this postseason. They're going to turn things over to the right-hander from the bullpen here as they ask Rafael Betancourt to come in and shut these guys down. The 
The 1-0 pitch on the way. On the ground to short, Kuzmanov. He'll throw on the first, and the side is retired. And that's a three up, three down inning. Eight innings are in the books. It's on to the ninth. The Padres lead three to two. And the two, three, four spot. Ground ball to short. Tejada. Over to first, four out number one. That shortstop's right there to glove it. And then fires to first base for the out. Base is empty, one out. The pitch. Here's the pitch. Grounded down the first base line. Swing and a liner to left. Erstad is right there as he puts it away. They had the outfield deep that time, but he crosses up on him and hits one in front of them. Great range to hustle in and make the play. Bases empty, two down. First pitch on the way. Smash toward the middle. That one gets through and for a base hit. And with two down, they've got a man aboard here. You've got to be disciplined as a hitter to be able to go out and get that pitch down and away. But he's been able to hit that pitch pretty well most of his career. And he does it again here. Two down, a runner at first. Ground ball toward the second baseman. That should be a base hit. He's going to try for third. A little two-out base knock here. That will keep the inning alive and give them a chance to build on this slim lead. Two down, runners at first and second. With the lead and a slow runner, I'm not risking a steal in this situation, John. You got to depend on good hit. And here's a fly ball to straightaway left. First down makes the catch of the side of the is getting himself ready out there in the bullpen. I'm not seeing any signs of fatigue here, John. But if the manager's not happy with the performance he's seeing, he's got every right to get a guy warmed up. Here's the pitch on the ground to first. Gonzalez and a step on first for out number one. Nice play over there at first. Just to that one for himself. Nobody on base with one out. First pitch is a curveball outside. One and oh. Now the one oh delivery from Bettencourt. Curveball just misses. And he falls behind two and oh. Two old pitch. Here it comes. Here's one pop foul. Here's the two and one pitch. Here's a swing and a miss at the heater. And we're even now, two and two. The two two pitch grounded towards third, but that'll go foul. Now the two and two pitch. That swung on and grounded up the middle. And that goes through a base hit. And he pulls into first with that base hit with one out. Jojima will stand in. He's 0 for 2 thus far. One on, one out. First pitch to him. Slider just misses. One ball, no strikes. Nice try. He started at the middle of the plate, but it broke too far off the outside corner.
Now he sets. Here's the hit the shortstop. Could be two. Makes its way through for a base hit. They tried to sneak a first pitch fastball by him, but he was sitting dead red and just whacked it in the left field. Darren Erstad is up now, still looking for his first home run in this series. Runners at first and second with one out. He delivers. Fastball in there, and it's 0 and 1. On the way. And a ground ball. Gonzalez. Who tough to lay off that fastball, but he did. One and two. Here's the one two pitch on the. There's a swing and a ground ball. Change out, swung out, and missed, and that is out number two. Good pitch on the outside edge. He couldn't do anything with that one. That's a tough pitch with two strikes. Two men on, two men out. First pitch, here it comes. That swung out and hit right on the deep center field. Jones is there, makes the catch, and the ball game is over. The San Diego Padres have battled back to win this big ball game, Joe, and to get themselves even in this series. And, John, I wouldn't be the least bit surprised to see this thing come down to a deciding game. Thank you, John. And one thing that really made things tough on the opposing hitters in this one was tremendous pitching. And Steve, I think we've got a lock for our Chevy player of the game. Well, there's no question that the old veteran left-hander has still got it, judging by his performance on the mound. I mean, Tom Glavin just schooled these hitters today. He showed his fastball inside, but got him out of way. He was outstanding. 